do see smaller uh, prop planes or uh, smaller aviation uh, stuff that uh, flies around here, sometimes doing movies and things like that. But uh, in all my years down here, and I've lived down here for about 20 years within uh, walking distance easily of the building, I've never heard anything like this. And that's, what, that's why I, I just immediately glanced up and just followed the, the track of this sound and this huge plane that was swooping over my head. Could you see any markings on it whatsoever? No, I did not. It was too, too quick. I, 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 I can't uh, give you any kind of identifying help on, do, on, on what, it, what it was. Do you remember what color it was? Was it, was I, it? My impression was, and, uh, was that it had a tan uh, coloration to it. Mm -hmm. However, mm -hmm. uh, the sun it was very low mm -hmm. in the horizon, and I think uh, kind of orange. And it may have been simply the color of the sun reflecting off a silver um, exterior. I, I really am not sure of that. Okay, Mark, anything else? What's the, what's the, uh, what's the mood in the environment oh, down there at the I moment as if it's I not mean, hard to imagine? The, the, and everyone who, who glimpses it close up, it's quite different seeing it from the ground than on, on these television pictures that I'm now looking at because it's, it's close to you and you, you see what the impact must have been like and you see the kind of devastation that uh, has, has uh, incurred by, by the buildings and it's just uh, it's, it's, uh, it's frightening is uh, perhaps even too mild a word. Okay. Um, it's absolutely uh, just a, a horrible, horrible sight. It, 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 it reminds you of the worst kind of effects mm. in movies that you know, you're reassured watching a movie that it's an effect, but this is not. Well, Mark, uh, you and I are supposed to have a meeting not long from now. Uh, we'd prefer you to go and work the story, if you would, and call us back as soon I as you can. I will indeed. Many thanks. Mark Obenhaus, one of our senior producers on the phone who saw the incident, describes it as a large plane, not sure what the color was, not sure the number of engines it had, which, in his mind, he's a very experienced reporter, reflects the speed and surprise with which this aircraft, this is the first one we're talking about now, just before 9 o'clock, approached the World Trade Towers from the north, um, causing the first huge gap in the building. And, and Mark describes the, the plane being engulfed in some respects by the building. Didn't see wings fall off, saw it go absolutely, uh, uh, totally almost as he described it, into the building itself. And we now have had one of the enormous difficulties about terrorism, everybody knows, is that you, you uh, 